Today, I'll be forced to retreat into a base designed to deceive my enemy. How does it deceive? Why do I need to deceive anyone? Well, we get straight into it when I come across this clan's bridge and decide to make it my own. This clan's made a bridge. Do we want to move into it? I kind of want to live in their bridge. Living in a clan's bridge. Wooden wall for TC. They don't appear to be online right now. Oh, garage door open there. Oh, I want this loot. I don't even know how to get in. But I want this loot. All right, we're living in this bridge. Marked. Bang. Okay, that scared me. We have a target. Before we could take over the bridge, we would need to destroy that tool cupboard, which meant we'd need some blueprints. So we would need a starter base. But before doing that, I just wanted to hop into their compound with this ladder I found. Oh, wow. Someone else died to this turret. Jokers. What the hell? I don't know where these turrets are, guys. I'm just going to risk this. I don't care about this loot I've got on me. Oh, are you kidding me? Oh, it's roof cap. Noted, roof camper. I see you. I see you. You are gonna get raided if you continue. I just watched Avatar, guys. Honestly, I'm gonna door camp the shit out of you if you roof camp. Mark my words, I will door camp the shit you out of you. You know that that's, that's their way of saying I love you. And for those of you that don't recognize their voice, I'm joined by my teammate and friend, Sora. He's got AKs. I think, oh my god, I'm just going to climb on his roof and just dive in. Well, I guess I'm going to have to introduce him. This is probably the most pathetic man you'll ever meet in Rust, and we're going to call him the Snitch. If anyone watching knows this base design, please let me know. It's honestly the best base I've ever dealt with when it comes to self-defense, and you'll see this later. Multi turrets. Okay, wow, they got. Okay, these these guys are rich. They got lots of turrets in the core. <gasps> Is that you? Uh, Who's the DB guy? Jump in! Jump in! Why does he live there? He's destroying the ladder. He must be allied with them. I retreated to outpost in order to try and make a weapon to attack the snitch. Games like Rust can be quite intimidating for new people because, well, everyone else is so experienced. Well, have no fear. I've got one that evens the playing field. I'm excited to bring to you my sponsor, Watcher of Realms. Watcher of Realms is a next-gen fantasy RPG, a magical world that will immerse you with its epic visuals, rich and diverse gameplay, and the bit I'm excited about, they have over 100 heroes to collect with a development system that keeps you wanting more. My favourite being Regulus, half human, half lion, with his high health, he is a must-have for defence. Watcher of Realms is the new pinnacle of quality when it comes to RPG games. With its high quality, audio visual effects are highly immersive. You'll instantly fall in love with your heroes due to the insane detail, top tier motion and facial capture technologies. The game has grand worldview and rich storylines to always keep you entertained. With each hero having their own unique storyline, there is so much to unlock. The gameplay is user friendly and deeply strategic. With six types of heroes, you'll need to know their strengths and weaknesses in knowing when to summon them into battle. Defeat menacing bosses on each level for rich rewards and team up with guild partners to challenge the epic dragon and rush to the top of the guild rankings. No matter how good your team is, in PvP the enemy will always try and out-scheme you and when you win, be sure to let everyone know Seppi K sent you. It has refreshing diverse RPG elements, fight monsters to get those rare resources, strengthen your hero by finding gear. The game also provides players with convenient features such as auto-enhance and auto-fight. Do you still think Watcher of Realms is just an ordinary RPG game? Watcher of Realms is doing a team competition where you can join the top influencers teams to get giveaways such as iPhones, Xbox, and Switch. So don't miss out and use my link in the description to join this event and download this game using my QR code. Thank you, Outpost. Oh shit, man. He messed up big time. He's home, so he's home in here. Fuck! 
Donella, okay. He's home. With the base owner online, there wasn't much we could do. So we got to start by throwing down a starter base. We were now going to work towards taking over this bridge. Right next door to us was an active base that looked like Eco Raid Heaven. Yep, worth checking out. Wow, so many dead bodies in this base. What is going on? Oh my god, Sora. Our neighbor's got wood frame here. These doors open. The guy's a joker. A quick farm in the ocean saw us get the scrap we needed to craft a tier 1 workbench, which then would enable us to craft weapons. Move campers back. Got up. And now you can put a name to the snitch, Katina. There's that AK again. Oh my god. Oh, did you lose the sock? Yeah, hold on. Jump by Erwin, our neighbor. Sora and I knew that we'd need to take out this space before they took us out. Where does he live? Just next door to us. Sora and I set out to regress to raid our neighbors and we didn't believe it would take too much whilst always keeping an eye on Danella and his bridge. We'll get them. We've got three targets, guys. It's pretty cool. We just need to... I want to move into the bridge, but maybe we should take out these other targets first. Oh, we're getting flame raided. Are we? Well, they tried, but it failed. Because <laughs> they planted the base in the water. You motherfucker. Yeah, but they too, Sancho. Watch it. I just made that fucking tier one. Yeah. Urban. Yeah, this guy looks at the saw. What can we make? What can we make? What can we make? I full charged him. I'm downed. I full charged him. That fire was awful. We're on. Surviving a weak attempt at a raid from our neighbors, Sora and I continued to progress. We rushed down the tier one tech tree to Satchel so that we could raid our neighbors, but we weren't quite there yet. We would need to farm a bit more scrap. Water pipe. What the heck? Amazing, I think that's Katina, the roof camper. Hearing a fight at our neighbor's base, I went over with a water pipe. I'm friendly, I'm here for the loot.
Sora! This gun got up here. Using your body for storage, sorry. What are you doing? Sorry, I needed your body for storage. I went full deep. Not full, but I went deep. Fuck these kids, man. Okay, somebody's inside. I want them to go and open the garage door. Passed out the best loot to Sora, and then I tried to go full deep. Two. Yeah, I'm dead. Yeah, I wasn't going any deeper there. But yeah, um, we've sent them back. GG. As the day progressed, we were getting closer and closer to being able to raid these boys. And I like to make sure to keep tabs on them in case they upgraded and the raid cost became more. So I got a spear gun and diving cat, which I decided to take straight to Orig to see if I could get any loot. Molotov, saw a Molotov. Ugh. It appears somebody had recently done Orig and left loads of loot behind. Yeah, some dicks just left it. <gasps> I hit some gold, Sora. Um. Uh, um. <laughs> There's loot, Sora. I grabbed the best of it and went home. Does that count as me doing all rig chat? I think it does, right? I just did all rig. Sebby's lad, chatty lad. Okay, I've learned pistol bullets now. We're it's getting there. We're getting there. Good job on the scrap. I will make satchel. Fire I learnt. Bang. Right, 10 stashes. We're gonna have to do this with revies and DBs, I think. If that's... There's, that might be the roof camper guy. He's... Is he talking about boom, boom, boom to someone? Now, whilst editing this, I can add so much context to this, but I'm going to wait for you guys to find out yourselves. But for now, all you need to know is that there's the roof camper, the snitch, Katina, telling the guys in the water with the bridge if they have any boom to raid us. Right, do you want to run out and test? There's no one here. Ready? Is it good? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's good, it's good, it's good. He is home, by the way. Remember, this is an online... You go first down, go down. And this breaks. Wait for the fire. I heard a door close. Yeah. I'll chop. It's inside. It's inside, so that's. He's actually made it. I think he's gone outside. Don't know. No, 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 he's not. I'm gonna throw a grenade when the next one breaks, okay? Hey, marker. This is unlocked. Dead, dead, dead. Authorizing. Watch your bags. Watch your bags. Oh, fuck, fuck, I need wood and the building plan. Wood, got it. Hold on. Hey, that is so good, 
coming to you guys. There is a guy coming to you guys. And white out. Just so you know. For the upstairs seal. He's with us all guys. Hold on. Here too, yes. Alright, you can get back, Sora. I'm clearing TC. Cleared, authed. Hey, that's it. We're being raided. We are being raided. Seb! Seb, we're being raided. I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. We're being raided. Where? Main base? We are. Yes. I think I'm coming to help Hey, oh my god, rockets. You kill yourself, I'm going out. I'm dead, he's okay. Told ya. It's like the hamster for me. I've felt everyone here. Got a star. It's dead. One dead inside. Okay, do you want to destroy them? And a weapon? Where are you? I'm dead. Donella. Donella's the uh, river base. And just like that, we gained a new base with a tier two and lost our old base. It's okay, we actually have a. We've upgraded base to a tier, base to the tier 2 chat. We're fine. Loot lost isn't too much. We weren't in any position to do any damage to the guys down in the water just yet. So we went to check out the snitch's base, not knowing his full relationship yet with the boys in the water. Dale, dale. Dale. Dale, dale, dale. Is he on the roof? Dale, dale, I die so fuck. He, th he thinks the uh, the flame traps are going to kill me. Fuck you. You will die. He had a lot of doors and it made going deep really hard. So we decided to go and check on the water boys as we had a pump shotgun and thought maybe we could make it play for an AK. One, one guy, one guy. On the door, on the door. He just grasped me up. He's here. Here, on the door, on the door. You fucking little whiny bitch. He killed me, he killed me. I know I killed you. I see, I see, I see here. Data, data, all the data. He's down there talking to him. Yeah. They then start taking heli, so we hope that it lands in the water. Maybe we can escape with a crate. Good, 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 good. Down. It's not in the water. No. Nope. It's so close to the water. We couldn't get near because the snitch was protecting the heli loop with a bolty. Katina. On his roof with a bolty. They're working together. With Katina working with the water boys, we scrapped the bridge idea. They also knew where our new base was that we raided. We moved all our loot into one base. This TP base. Sora had a group of TP bases base design in mind, and we we're going to roll with this. This way, when the enemy attacked us, they wouldn't know which one to hit. That was it for me for the night, so I logged off and let Sora do his thing. When I came on the next day, what's the plan today? Um, well, it's no longer living in the clan's bridge. I think it's going to be the TP base. This is Sora's. Oh, we got Tara, if I'm not all Sora. <gasps> shooting outside 
I like it, Sora. I like it. I like it. I'm gonna grab a gun and try and kill this guy outside. I don't think we have. Oh, I do it. Sora's got like a design in mind. I'm gonna quickly multiply this star. Uh... Hmm. Should I? Fuck it. One dead. Shit, I didn't even see him. I will take 250 scrap. That will that's worth banking. 700 cloth. Okay, I I, I traded up. I traded up. It was time to progress and I would take any opportunity I could. And of course, that would mean the water boys. As nobody was home, I let myself in. Which one shot me? Taking their turrets down was going to be a real long process. But in the meantime, I went to do Auric, but once again, somebody had taken it and just left loads of loot there and not taken the full crate. And that's when Cargo came past. Uh, I'll have a boat in a second, though. I'll have a boat in a second. The rib's just gone. The rib has just escaped. Jahuka. Hundred and forty eight, fuck me. Take me some of that. Hell yeah, I'm countering. Fortunately for me, they didn't loot me and I was able to get my boat again, and this time I went the opposite way around the map to intercept. They won't jump now unless there's boats or rig. They'll probably jump when it gets closer to shore near large fishing village, I would assume. With the rib on the back of the boat being gone, I saw an opportunity to intercept them when they were swimming. Oh, I see them. They bought a boat. Oh, I killed him. Three people. Hello, Full Metal. <laughs> oh my God, what a play. Now that last body. That's it. Change your flicker nets. Don't need a grenade. I'm off. I'm off now. That was a that shit crates, mate. No um, airdrops, good. But yeah, but no boom. Shit.
I must, I must not. Was I crouched? Was I still sitting in the boat as opposed to standing on it, chat? I was sitting, was I? Fuck's sake. That is how Ross goes sometimes. So we went back to the drawing board. We wanted to build the TP quadruple base design. And on top of that, Sora had a beef with a neighbor. And of course, we needed to deal with the roof camper and the water boys. Just next door. Need to go on the roof. The chat, the story behind this is this guy door camped Sora yesterday. I want my pure ore back. I'm a jackhammer. He says he was going to raid me. Yeah. He says, oh, I know how many doors he has. Yeah, he hasn't upgraded. So he's three doors. Uh, TC's right here. I'll set up here then. Yeah. Come over when you're at TC. Another tier two, TC, double metal door. Shamika's the name. Yeah, your jackhammer's in here, but I don't see a T. Ah, oh, I'm dead. Bro, right, can you close the door behind me? Yeah, he's going side. He's going side. Yeah, go, 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 go. He's away side. He's dead. That's him that killed me. That was him that killed me. Now, the reason I'm showing you this is because this is a new character that we've just been introduced to, Frederick, and he's going to be an enemy of the TP bases. Oh, not good. He's dead. Oh! They actually loaded it. Yeah. I think he said you guys are raided. I think. Question is, which one's his base? Unaware of Frederick's base location, we knew it was urgent that we find it because our TP base wasn't very strong right now. We needed to finish off creating the quadruple TP base design to secure our loot. And in the meantime, I used any opportunity I could to visit the water boys and gain a gun or two. This base has given us an ass whooping. It's unattended and it's given us an ass whooping. Bolty Taurus, a badass. <laughs> <gasps> yes, mother body fell into the water, the glitched one. Get in. I don't want to put in a million deaths in this video, but this base honestly must have made me die a hundred times. I was literally doing respawn simulator, but I did eventually destroy a turret and get in. Got it. <laughs> oh, so look at this. Wow, these guys are loaded. So we blew through a window to check out the loot and this is probably one of the richest bases I've ever seen. Right, is that food? Tell me there's food. More guns, Not more anything. guns. Thanks. Breakaway, so a breakaway. And these are all locked. What I wanna do, is... yeah, everything's locked. Go you look at the boxes first and I'll explain what I wanna do. Armor, door, garage, door. So they've got ceiling, ceiling materials here. Jackhammer's red key cards. Box, half box of metal smelted. Ooh, a box of metal. Two boxes of metal ore. And then, oh my God, one door to core. Right. What I'm thinking is maybe in the sulfur one, might be sulfur. Let's go. You ready to grab it? Oh my god! Empty? I didn't reach it. I didn't reach it. No, it's done bottom left. <gasps> oh my god! What the fuck? I'll go first. Day three, man. It's not even closed. Yeah, watch it. They've moved everything upstairs. Yeah, it rings upstairs. I the, it's, I've got it on the side here. Loads. Oh my Stop god! 
if you haven't already figured out they got banned and that's why we were able to get all this loot through one window because they left all doors open as they were banned mid game now i don't want to bring too much attention to this kind of thing because it gets a bit boring because it happens every time i play now somebody's getting banned for cheating however that's not going to stop me wiping them out and also wiping out the snitch and on top of that we now have to deal with frederick who is threatening the existence of our tp bases but first things first we bought a mini and transferred all this loot why are the any why is saw an enemy <laughs> why the fuck does this have a scope on it my god Zoomed in HL <laughs> launcher. Run and open the door quick. Go, go. I'm dropping. Try and keep it relatively organized. We've got the GP box, the boom box, sorry. And after transferring the loot, we started work on the quadruple TP base design. So we've got purple TP, got green TP. Next will be an armor TP. Yeah, this is cool. <laughs> yeah, what the fuck is this? The seat of the sky. I know. <laughs> what the hell? That's messed up. Wait to see how Sora decorates them now as well. What? <laughs> Oh my god. We have an arm we have an armored TP. <laughs> Look at the fucking <laughs> ceiling panels. Seb, yeah. we can make this into a roleplay room. We can put a disco ball and everything in it. With the base is taking shape, it was now time to go raid the snitches base. Close this. Close that. Great to TC. Snitch was broke. He was given guns by the water boys by the looks of it, and he just gave them all his sulfur. I think he farmed boom for them, you know. I think probably, yeah. That's the AK, see? They gave him an AK. He has the Ocus. He has the Ocus. Run up, Omega. It's one of you. Yeah, there's a. Uh... Go up, 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 up. I've got lots of rockets on me. Jump off and jump in. Jump off and jump in. Our TP bases were beginning to draw a lot of attention. <laughs> what happened? Weirdo on the base. Can't stop the music. Ain't gonna go get a window. Get on the bus or that? Him. Him. Whilst building the TP bases, we'd heard some commotion earlier, and that's when we discovered where Frederick lives. He actually has a team, and he lives in this base. So I went to investigate it. They've got an auto tire at the front of their base. The 
the roof tower is gone. Zora, left doors open. Yes. They think the tower is going to protect them. Come to me. Let's stop them what I'm doing. That shit all the they were definitely online, they just weren't home right now. And with the threat of us being raided, we decided to hit them first. In the middle, yeah. Ooh, hang on. There you go. Armored door. Wow. Burn it off. Sulfur, he's planning on raiding us. Uh yeah. Are more doors on? Yeah, oh, open. Um, yeah. Low in there. Good, I'm low. Hey, do you have a armored wrap round now? Open. Wait, wait. All open. Right in the car. <laughs> Rocket launcher. We can sit in this box. Someone's this outside, box. someone's outside. You got something to take TC out with? Um, I could possibly, yeah. Here, yeah, there, 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 there. Yeah. You got wood for TC? Uh, I got 525. Just. 100. Killed him. Oh my god, the scrap. I'm gonna make doors. Stand back. Got it. Drop down from up top. Okay, I'll make another door. Can you see this? Part? That helped. <laughs> uh, oh my god, I didn't even try to do that nicely. Kill two. Hey, ladder. Do we have anything to take out this door? Uh, rockets. Ah, uh, fuck it. Oh, uh, hold on. We can break, can break out. You can break that yeah. and then jump up. We got a ladder. Now they come in. Come in. We almost pushed each other up there. That was weird. That was weird. <laughs> Good job, guys. Good job. GG. GG. With the main threat for the TPs extinguished, we thought we could log off safely that night. With the compound as well, surely we were secure. Which TP would they hit? We had an armored one as a disguised one, and this is what they look like inside. Come to raid. Like, which one would you raid? <laughs> that's, that's the problem right there. You go for the purple, the green, the armor, or the stone? Lol. Musical instruments. We have, um, we've got the two bouncers as well. You know, they gotta keep an eye on everyone. Snowman. Okay, so the armor TP, let's have a look. Is, oh my god, it's all auto smelting. This is the armor TP, is this auto smelter? Oh my god, all the metal smelted already. <laughs> Fucking hell, Sora, you've been busy. As I said, I haven't been gone that long, and this is the uh, the depot one we used. Charcoal. The ring sorted in here too. This is just dump stuff. Nothing. Oh my god. Wood. Oh, Wood. Metal. There's a lot more metal. And then here, look at this box here. Fucking hell. And then the back one's stone. Are we under attack. 
This is so much fun. Windmill. But that night, someone did hit us and they raided it in a very specific way. We would need to get revenge. Guys, make sure you subscribe to find out what happens next. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next week.